Mr. Chairman, I'm heartened that Budget 2019 acknowledges climate change as a strategic challenge for Singapore. The financial sector's role in allocating capital for a climate-safe future across generations is a significant role. It's a significant one that we must include in our strategic plan for climate change action. As a leading financial hub, Singapore's banking and asset management industry must rise to this challenge. How we land is a reflection of our values and principles. For example, civil society recently called out our banks for continuing to fund coal-fired power. As of September 2018, 17 banks have committed to stop financing coal-fired power. The Governor of Bank of England is reported to be open to increase regulatory requirements for brown investments. What regulatory and supervisory mechanisms are being developed so that banks in Singapore will a, actively implement existing green standards like ABS Hayes Diagnostic Kit into their lending policy frameworks? and b proactively work with civil society and experts to identify other critical industries like energy where green standards should be developed and implemented our asset management industry currently manages us 2.4 trillion dollars can we allocate funds to support our asset management industry to develop stronger stewardship principles and use the tools available in the market to help us safeguard our future one that is climate safe for example, the Government Pension Investment Fund of Japan allocates close to 10% of the investments into funds using sustainability indices. Two pension funds in Korea have gone even further and stepped away from future coal investments. Thank you.